and basically argue with other Wednesday fans about Wednesday. Hi guys, welcome to the Sheffield Wednesday Brentford review. Now, both teams had great results at the weekend, both got a bunch of goals, both conceded a goal, so in that terms, very equal. And we're very close on the table, Brentford are on the up at the moment, Wednesday are starting to get that weight as well, so it should be a very good game. Now, there is no Zhao in the team tonight. He has been replaced by Forstier. Apparently, he's got a knee injury. We want no suspensions. We want no injuries in this game because we've got the big one coming up on Monday. Now, the team new today is Westwood, Palmer, Fletcher, Bannon, Lee, Reach, Hutchinson, Hector, Lazar, Aarons and Forstier. Subs are Dawson, Poodle, Iorfa, Pelopusi, Matthias, Boy, New Hugh. Like I said, the one change is that uh, Fourth Dairy is back after serving his suspension, which is fantastic. It'll be great to have him back. If we can get him amongst the goals, that'll be even better. Fletcher will be on the high. We're getting a goal out of will reach. And thing kind of clicked on Saturday. It really did click. And Swansea are not a bad team. But we have to be careful with Brentford. They are a team that are very attacking when they get going. So hopefully we can have a good game and get all three points. Well, we are 1-0 up at half-time. Fantastic goal by Stephen Fletcher. Great ball from Bannon to pick him out. He's not running great at the minute. He does seem like he's pick it, carrying a knock. So we might see a change at half time. But all in all, that was a fantastic first half for Wednesday. Did what we did against Swansea, high pressure in, making them make mistakes, making them uh, just had to work a lot harder. We had a clear penalty that wasn't given, but we've had a lot of good chances and we've been all over them. We've tried to get the ball a lot more. Hutchinson's on the yellow card, so he's got to be careful. Uh, the only big thing that was a Big shame was the Lazar, losing Lazar. He had been fantastic. Granted, we've only seen him the last game in this game, but he started ever so well, and it looked like he might have pulled his hamstring. And if that's the case, he'll definitely be out for the derby. But that's what happens when you have a player who hasn't played much football, and now he starts playing two games in a row. It might have been too much, or just going for it and just not remembering how your body is and kind of thing. But we're 1-0 up, it's a great start, we're playing some fantastic football and we deserve it, we absolutely deserve it. They have not really had many chances, there was one from Canos and West with a very comfortable save. Uh, Palmer and Reach have been doing superbly getting down the wing. We have been really, really good. The only thing I would say is that Fortieri has been a bit non-existent in this game. Uh, he had a couple of good chances right near the beginning of the game, but that's been about it. You need to get a bit closer to Fletcher for me to win the knockdowns and try and do that. But apart from that, it's been a fantastic performance so far. The only downside would be losing Lazar, Hutch is yellow, not getting a penalty, and probably Fletcher picking up a knock. But hopefully we'll be alright. But it won't surprise me if we do see New Hugh in the second half. So, second half, we get a second goal, Stephen Fletcher double, which is fantastic. We do well, we play some good football, uh, Hutchinson was lucky, lucky at times, did crunch and tackle even though he was on a yellow, but we played well, played really good football. Dot then coming forward, had, they had a couple of great chances right near the end of the game in the 86th an 87th minute, uh, great save by Westwood though to deny them, but we get all three points, we get a clean sheet, we get all three points and our form going into this have been brilliant, uh, we started to look a little bit better, started to play better, starting to take these chances now as well, so going into this derby it's really good, the only downside about this game would have been losing Lazar, uh, it looks like he's left the ground on crutch, which doesn't look good, but yeah, that's just a precaution. But it doesn't look good for him because he's been outstanding the last two games he played. But that's the risk you get when you don't play for ages. So, it's three points. It's another win. We are on 47 points. The three of us on 47 points as well. Uh, anyone in that little period 47 points and 50 
from there on we could do a playoff push I feel I think it completely 100% possible but we've got some tough games if we're going to do that uh, we're still going to play Derby we're going to play Leeds United we're going to play Norwich we're playing Sheffield United on Monday so we've got the top three in theory that we're still going to play so it will be tough and if one does think you don't want to talk about pushing players you just want to see how far we can get now but you never know it's that whole thing of looking at the table going mm. but let's just see how we do and just carry on that we're doing because we're doing well but it's derby it's the derby on monday so it'll be interesting to see how we do in that. Bruce will have them playing and get them up for it and hopefully can get all three points in that. But it's three points tonight. Don't forget to go to outtalk.co.uk after this video.